On July 1st, ECSI made some modifications to our policies related to renewal or recertification of an ECSI card. While we understand it's difficult for students to get back into the classroom to practice their skills testing, we found it be very important that students at least refresh their cognitive information in order to extend their certification beyond its recommended renewal date. Students will now be required to complete the online interactive program, whether it be for standard first aid, CPR, or AED, basic life support or healthcare provider, or EACLS, in order to extend their certification date. The online interactive program is meant to renew or refresh the cognitive information, as well as the sequencing around providing resuscitation or first aid skills. We know it's difficult to get into the classroom to practice those skills, so we are extending the certification 120 days for anyone who completes the online interactive program. This should give students sufficient time to find an education center that is able to test their skills in a safe and appropriate manner based on local laws or rules related to the coronavirus or COVID-19. We want everyone to be safe. Giving the 120 day extension allows education centers, instructors, and participants to find the right environment to practice their skills and be tested towards their certification. If you're unable to complete your certification or skills testing component after the online interactive program, you'll have another 120 day extension should it be necessary if you go back and review the online interactive program. Again, our key focus is the safety of our participants, our instructors, and our education centers. Additionally, we know that your ability to respond is related to your willingness. Your willingness is related to your confidence in responding to an emergency. So going online, refreshing that information, and even practicing the physical skills at home with a pillow or a stuffed animal in the meantime may be of benefit for some of our lay responders.